hello friends welcome to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to show you how to download and install windows 11 in your macbook so if you are using a latest macbook like m2 or m m1 chip or m3 chip uh, you can easily download uh, windows in your uh, macbook for free so how to download it i am going to show you full guide how to download and install windows 11 in your m2 m1 or m3 chip so uh, first i am going to show you that this is m2 chip and it will work in m3 m3 chip also okay this is apple m2 chip now i'm going to show you how to do it so first you have to go to your browser i'm using google chrome so i'm going to google chrome and now here you have to search for utm download okay now just search for utm download and here you will see first results just click on it virtual machine for mac now here you will see two options windows and mac app store so if you download it from mac app store you have to pay for it but if you download from directly from here uh, it is free so i'm going to download it from here for free version so just click on it and it will start downloading here okay now click on save now you will see that this is 228 mb okay means 228 mb file so uh, let it be download and half also you have to go to gallery and one thing you have to also download uh, here for uh, so i want to if you want to download windows 11 you have to download this one okay now you have to click on it and here you will see architect arm64 and memory 8 gb and disk 20 gb so you have to also click on guide so when you click on guide here you will see all the instructions and you have to download this crystal fetch okay now you have to click on download on the app store so now click on it and it will open app store and you have to download it from there okay now uh, i have to open the open store open the store and i have to download it from Okay, wait for a few seconds now click on get and you have to download it from here now you will see that crystal fetch iso downloader has been installed so this is installer for windows 11 now first we have to go and see now utm you will see utm dmg has been uh, downloaded now i have to install it now click on it and when you click on it you will see here in the downloads okay now you have to double click on it and here you will see you have to drag it to the applications okay now you have to drag it to the applications now you will see that it has been downloaded now go to uh, now again now you have to click on this open okay here click on open and here you have to choose uh, whether you are down you want to download windows 11 or windows 10 and here you have to uh, just tick uh, apple silicon now choose the language in which you want to download so i am going to choose english united states and addition will be if you can also choose windows 11 enterprise or windows 11 enterprise n but the normal one is best now just click on downloads and here you have to accept the terms and conditions here just click on it and wait for a few seconds uh, it will it is 5.24 gb so it will take some time it's been downloaded now what you have to do now here uh, you have to double click on utm okay now it will open here and click on open okay now here you have to click on create a new virtual machine okay click on it and now click on virtualize now here you have to click on windows and you have to uh, check install window 10 or higher and on check import vhdx image and now here you have to click on browse and we have downloaded that this one uh, 5.96 gb earlier now you have to click on and click on open
okay now click on now you have to also check install drivers and spice tools you have to choose the memory and you have to choose the to 4 okay cpu course is 4 now click on continue and here you have to just click on 30 okay uh, here you have to type 30 one minute three zero okay now click on continue and again continue and here you have to choose the name okay click on save now uh, here you have to just click on this play button and when you click on that play button you will see that windows is start boot options okay it is starting to now you have to uh, space here okay now here you will see installation has been started now it will take 2 minutes or 2 minutes 51 seconds remaining so you have to wait for a few seconds now here you will see like this now you can choose the language to install time and currency you can choose keyboard input method and now you can click select next now here you will see uh, your uh, activation keyword uh, key product key you have to enter but if you don't have just click on i don't have product key okay now here you have to just select windows home windows home single language or windows pro i am going to windows home for the windows home just click on next and here you have to click on i accept the microsoft software license terms click on next and now again click on next now copying windows file you will see here copying windows file getting files ready for installation now installation will be started like this wait for a few seconds and install it in uh, installing windows here you will see the option installing windows okay so wait for a few seconds and will installed in your macbook after that has been installed now here you will see cd and drive option okay so go, go back again that windows okay here and just click on here and here you will see under that you will see a clear option just you have to clear that and you have to clear click again here play okay now you will see that after a few seconds that has been installed started uh, and windows will be installed here okay preparing automatic repair all these options you will see here and wait for a few seconds diagnosing your pc and you will see that just a moment like this and you will see that windows 11 has been installed okay now i have to set up okay as i have to choose the language country keyword english india okay click on yes shake and skip and i have to also enter the name okay here i have to enter my name okay and just click on next and enter a password okay and click on next and password confirmation okay, click on next and security question will ask pet name tommy click on next and after all these procedures you have to enter to use child's name so next question number three and oldest cousin now here i have to enter city where i born okay like this and click on next and after a few seconds you will see that i have successfully installed windows 11 in my macbook so uh, here again you will see checking for updates okay so wait for a few seconds after that it will be 
this windows 11 will be installed so like this you can install windows 11 in your macbook so if you like this video please like my video and also subscribe my channel for more videos like this thanks for watching